Welcome back to the Cognac, Tequila, and the Girl Show. It's time to hang out with Rob, Mike, and Dunia. Whatever you don't want to say, they will with no chaser. Take a shot and let's have a drink. Is hashtag squad goals still a thing? Because they are. Let's go. Welcome back, everyone. Hello. Welcome back, welcome back to Cognac Tequila and the Girl. Thanks for joining us again. Um, this is episode 178, and we will be just chit-chatting. There's a lot to chit-chat about this week, y'all, especially if you're from Houston, Texas. Um, <laughs> we'll, we'll get into that later. <laughs> it doesn't matter. Yeah. We're just it's good to... In Texas, Jamaica, the, um, anywhere mm-hmm. that Barrel touched. <laughs> Barrel, bitch. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anyways. Um, Good old Merle. Merle, Merle. Depends <laughs> <Okay. laughs> on neck of the woods. <laughs> that, that was my California Barrel. <laughs> well, that last, damn Barrel. <laughs> last week, we was talking about um, cities getting um uh, Giving Houston bad rep, like Katie, but mm-hmm. that ain't Houston. That's mm-hmm. Katie. Come on now. <laughs> Daryl said we all Houston, Houston, Houston and all all of us around. The <laughs> I got you. <laughs> I'll show you what's Houston. <laughs> my, bad. my bad, y'all. Especially for for being okay. <laughs> well, um, where I reside. Yeah. Before we get into that and this chit chatting, how is your? <laughs> what? It's probably gonna all roll around barrel at this point, or they go barrel. Um, how was your week, Tequila? My week was oppressive. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> <laughs> that is such a strong word, but it's so accurate. <laughs> no, no elaboration. I mean, I can get them a definition. <laughs> they better know. <laughs> <That's> oppressive. <laughs> like, actually, you should give a definition because some people don't understand what oppression is. Of, of, uh, oppressive. Of weather. Excessively hot and humid. Period. That's what it was all week. What's the uh, weather that's definition? Excessively hot and humid. Oppressive. <laughs> Y'all know what it means. <laughs> It's hot right now, yeah. actually. I'm telling you, you're good. How was your week, uh, Cognac? Um, my week was okay, actually, because I had the fundamental um, function to have gas in my car. Luckily. <laughs> filled, you know, yeah. I'm filled up with that girl's car. So. As you should. Yeah. You know, yeah. And. Um, I was on standby for the marauders to come over and they don't come. Y'all better not to come. Not the marauders. <laughs> yeah. Lord. Y'all better not. Y'all come. Google that definition. Come over here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It sure is. What he, what he means is this is a very fuck around and find out household. Yeah. I, I had to. I had to go in the closet and sit down and. and have a talk with my mom. <laughs> my son, he already knows. Yeah, that yeah, yeah, is, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're, so we're basically a bit uh, fuck around and find out mm-hmm. squad here. Oh, yeah. <laughs> not this house. Not what? not this nope. one, please. Nope. Yeah. Not, yeah. not those houses. <laughs> Coming over here. Uh uh-uh. uh. Yeah. You. Which is very true, uh, not to cut you off, but I have a friend who's a wife of a police officer. They're both our friends, but uh, she said that they had to put the police officers on 12-hour shifts for that reason, because people are just burglarizing people's shit thinking that they're not home because they don't have power. And so, mm-hmm. shame on you. Mm-hmm. Yep. It was yeah. hot as hell, but God, it was so hot. but those uh, bullets would be hotter. <laughs> it, was, it was hotter than Samuel Jackson and Black Snake Mom. <laughs> <laughs> Which I think I look like Samuel Jackson. I think I look like him. Literally. Literally. <laughs> nah, you were so cute. She lied. These she extensions were so, about to come out. She was, still, no, 
should have still put the cute shit on. I wouldn't put on all. cute shit. I was I putting mean, on the like, breathable you know, shit. Well, yeah. I'm well, just cute. Yeah. I can't help that. Yeah. <laughs> I, was, I like that part of it. I guess. Okay. Yeah. And don't touch me. <laughs> Did you like yeah. the don't you fucking don't touch, touch me, me part? I'm too hot. You're too hot. Go sleep over there. We would mm. we even sleep in the same area. <laughs> well, we <laughs> just like, which was cooler. Yeah. We kind of you know, shifted around a little bit. Yeah. But then we ended up, anyways, yeah, we ended up sleeping. In my car? <laughs> that was the closest we Well, slept. because <laughs> you said my car is too uncomfortable to sleep in. You can't put the seat back, sir. But I could have. That was your week. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. That was my yeah. week. No. Getting this uh, heat fly off me. <laughs> I mean, honestly. Heat fly. <laughs> yeah, like, no, it was, uh, it, that was a lot. You know, um, you know what I'm saying? That girl from, uh, shout out to her, I can't think of her name on Instagram. Um, Yeah, like we've had worse storms here, but those winds were fucking, that was the first time I was ever like, the fuck is this? And it did not stop for hours and hours and hours. I was was listening for the choo-choo train. Yeah. (laughs) Yeah. Yeah. And my co my coworker, he said he heard the train. Yeah, he did? <laughs> yeah, no, Sienna. Yeah. And um he had they had a tornado in Sienna. Oh they did? Yeah. Oh see I didn't see why I didn't like watch the news. Um He yeah. said so he say he told his wife, get in the get in the closet, get in the closet. She so grabbed the baby and went to the window. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> She didn't hear him over them winds. Yeah. <laughs> so, no, yeah, that shit there was were only insane. Two shadows. Yeah, and it was for <laughs> that was like hours and hours of wind. And you know, normally storms like that, but when they hit land, they slow down. This one did not. It was just too no, big, just, and it said, "Fuck y'all." Fuck you. Yeah, I'm from the. I'm oh, from Jamaica. <laughs> you know, he was not. Nah, he's from yeah. yeah. So, well, like Harvey. Okay, I guess we're chit chatting. Or oh, you didn't let him finish. Oh, sorry. <laughs> no, we did. I was gonna say something. Go that, ahead. So they say the the tornadoes. If you look at where they come from, um, what part of the ocean is this conspiracy or <laughs> myth? So a lot of the slave ships. It's where a lot of slave ships sunk or they threw the bodies over, so the hurricanes are the spirits or whatever come from that. Oh, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I have heard that. Yeah. Well, that's not yeah. a conspiracy. It's not I also folklore. heard. Folklore, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I also heard. Which, I'm. The, thank you. I mean, y'all do what you do. Just save my black ass. <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> but, you know, also the Jews control the weather. Well, yeah, yeah. Marjorie so, Taylor Greene is probably going to get sit on yeah, sit yeah. on the uh, Senate and tell us that it was the Jews who did it. The Jews did it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so. But it was just a category one, so nothing. Yeah, but we've had worse <laughs> and less destruction. Yeah. Um, so well, I was go be... ahead, get, go ahead. Um, but we have segments we have. No. Yeah. So, anyways, the whole with well, the Harvard thing, it was just like sitting, and this one was just big. This one was like, the, this like one should have been named too, Ike. Like Harvey, kind of. It should have been named Ike. It um, was just sitting there beating and beating. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, that's what it was. Well, there we go. Because Mike was in here when we had that the, the eye come over and shit. Yeah. Remember? Shout out to Tequila for and coming then, to check on us because cell service yeah. sucked. And then he, it. yeah, and then he, you know, went back. I didn't answer the door though. I thought it was a neighbor. Or, yeah. I thought it was a neighbor. I didn't yeah. answer the door. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I answered the door my uh, under rules and I woke like, you up and I go, I think it's a neighbor I won't talk. And I said I'm just putting a tank top on, I guess whatever. Yeah, I went to uh, check on the job. One of the locations. My my where my office is, we can lose power at all. That's where yeah. I would have been sleeping. At my <laughs> uh, yeah, we can lose power. I flickered a little bit. But that was it. Mm-hmm. Uh, Kanye to be honest, I'm losing the power at all. Either. Yeah, they didn't. You know. That's the first time I seen. So I seen it on I ten in Memorial because how it go it go down and it's real low and it fill up with water under on I ten. But uh, I didn't know two twenty five did that over about two Richie two twenty five Richie. 
said turn into a fucking lake. Well, yeah. That shit was crazy. It looked apocalyptic. Damn man. Shit is underwater. Yeah. I didn't know. Yeah, I didn't see much wind over here. But the wind get we didn't get a lot of rain. Just a lot of wind. <laughs> we get more rain now, but it's right. gone. <laughs> right, right now, yeah. Oh my gosh, stop. Can we get to our segments and then we can get back to that? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck with the girl? Okay, so my what the fuck is for 50 Cent right now. Just, I was, I had a different one. But he just posted this picture, and let me show you guys. Show the camera. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you guys can see it. If you can't, then just go on Instagram and That's look funny. at 50 cents. Uh, you said, Trump gets shot, now I'm trending. What the fuck? <laughs> so I'm going, what the fuck with him too? It's basically Trump's face on his Get Rich or Die trucking album. <laughs> just, I can't, you know. Trump, can, Trump got shot. We can chit chat about that. Uh, Later. What the fuck with the girl? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, not for you. Got my damn joke. I wrote it down more. Yeah. Joking with cognac. Okay. Uh, damn. I wrote it down more. I came up with it today. As a matter of fact. Why are you scrolling so far? Damn. You took all the pictures today? Oh, okay. Yeah, no, I didn't. Um, <laughs> damn. My bad. You wasn't even ready. I know, because we're talking about that damn hurricane. Shit. Hold on. That's all they're talking before we. Oh, okay. yeah. All right. I got it. All right. That's why we What's the difference between <laughs> kinky and perverted? It's what you like. I don't know. Kinky is when you take your girlfriend with a feather. Perverted is when you use the whole bird. The whole bird. I feel like I've heard that before. Um, and, you know, sorry, Peter, for that joke. <laughs> Okay. All right. I, I, okay. But bird, bird, bird. But bird is a word. <laughs> That's a good song. Um, okay. So we can get back to chit chatting. Um, yeah. So um, I would be remiss if I don't bring up this as a good news outlet here. We are good, respectful um, journalists. Um, yeah. No, no, I'm not journalists. I'm just a civilian here um yeah trump there was a shooting at a trump rally a couple of hours ago i guess um i don't i i'm trying to wait for just the news to finish up so we can figure out what happened um i don't condone violence unlike him um and uh if that is what happened i'm sorry um that's that's not how you handle things. Not anymore. Um, and prayers up for, um, they say that the, the shooter and the one other person, that's what I just saw just now, are dead. Um, yeah, and news pending, breaking news pending. Yeah. But shout out to the people sitting behind him because I, you know, <laughs> that is some loyalty. <laughs> because I told Kanye, I could be sitting behind Jason Momoa, Idris Elba, Adele, Celine Dion, like people that I love and am obsessed with, quote unquote. And I'm out. <laughs> but in, and they, and they, I'm out. they, they gun told, and yeah, I ain't gonna say the other term. They used to crossfire. You know, okay, well, hunting and shit, I'm, I'm not anti-gun, and I'm still out. So, <laughs> um, most people shout out for y'all just sitting there with your signs and a lot cheering of, it on. And I hope 
um, former President Donald Trump got his shoes that he asked for from most, his way out. <laughs> most people. Oh, you, you wouldn't ask for your shoes? Absolutely not. <laughs> if someone's coming in my head, absolutely not. Keep them. Keep the Louboutins. Keep the last limited edition prod. I don't give a no. I don't, don't give a fuck about my shoes. Nope. First of all, don't even pick me up. Is, is the person dead? I if need to stay if, down on this fucking if ground. Got, if you got a train shoot the shoe match, it's hard. It ain't that much ducking in the world. Yeah. Ducking, running, and rolling, and you know what I'm saying. Oh boy, oh boy, boy. Yeah. Yeah. Duck them shoes. Don't <laughs> yeah. yeah. And he stayed the fuck down and everybody up there was like scared yeah. of a shoe. What nobody's yeah. scared of a fucking You know, look. Look. Yeah, they again. Dumping. They was dumping dog. I when you showed me that video, I thought like one shot, pow, they was pow, pow, pow. they was they was there. Yeah. That's what I said. Yeah. It was uh, yeah. three shots and then after that, five others. Yeah. From from what I heard. Yeah, yeah, for what, what we yes. what we yeah. heard on the video. Again, I'm gonna wait for the news, and again, I'm not condoning any of that. It just looks a little bit froggy to me. Um, yeah, because yeah, yeah. Remember, yeah. Should, should should Knight got shot in the air too. You got <laughs> shot. Wait, Mike Tyson got bit. Or Mike he Holyfield bit. bit. He when someone two Tupac got killed, they point blank range on the car, dumped on the car, should sitting right next to Tupac. All he do he got grazed on the ear. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't know that. Yeah, we watched. No, I didn't. I didn't remember that. Okay. No, I did hold the, uh, uh, hold this whole uh, on that shit. Yeah, I know. Shouldn't I get hit in the ear? Yeah, yeah. just just one shot. Yeah, just one, one, one. I know strategically he, placed shot. I didn't know he cleaned that. Yeah. That's what Trump, that's well, what he, Trump well, he shot <laughs> Kind of. I mean, I told you <laughs> Trump, there's Trump. a specific personality that would do some shit like that. So Trump it's like called sociopathic. So I don't I don't know. Again, the man thinks he, prayers he out a, to those uh, people. Burger King no. pick, uh, Okay. Here, here's here's, here's what, no, I did not say that. Here's what I said. I said I operate on common sense, not emotion. I operate that way in my daily life. Common sense says if someone is shooting at somebody's head and I'm sitting behind them, I'm not going to still be sitting behind them. You will not see me. If I'm laid under the bleacher, it's cool. What you will not see me doing is sitting back there with the sign and chanting and if the man that I love so much or person I love so much is standing there and he's only worried about getting his shoes and telling them to wait so he could take a picture, that should raise some type of common sense flags for a normal person. Well, if Biden, if this happened to Biden, everybody would be like, that's fucking bullshit. And I don't like either of these motherfuckers. Right. I'm sorry. It's just weird. And here's the picture. This is the picture. I mean, he said, wait to take a picture. If you're coming at my head, I don't care how fucking crazy I am. I got to get the fuck out of here. You're talking about a gangster. Yeah. They get shot at all the time. (laughs) That ain't his first time getting shot at that shit. You know what I'll wait for? (laughs) I will wait for a military, active military person or a military vet to explain how all of those shots rang. And nobody left from behind him, and he was nicked in the ear. Man, I, Trump act like Trump responded I, like I respect our military and our servicemen. So someone explain that to me. One of them. Trump right. responded like he was professional in, snipers. Trump responded like he was in a trap house, and his <laughs> officer just did a drive by on that bitch. And if he would had, you seen the movies where they do the drive by, and then the people in the house they run out of the house chasing and shooting. That's how Trump responded. If he had a gun, he would. Chase that person. He's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He a gangster. That was shit to him. He gonna tell you. He gonna tell you. Wait. People get shot out of town. I, <laughs> I react worse when a mosquito hits my ear. Like, I just... Like, I'm... I, yeah. So Trump, I, Trump did the... You the black power. Trump, Trump did the black power fist. Oh, after that... Which is my point. <laughs> if I'm freaked the fuck out over a mosquito at my ear, I'm damn sure freaking out if something hit my I mean, it was like a, you heard it and then he went, oh, and fell. Yeah. Like, it, it just, it was but like you've never been shot at me. <laughs> yeah, he's been shot at That's a crack house response. 
Okay. Hey, well, you sorry. Phone, what my shit? I didn't know. Yeah, I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know America in whole was a trap house or a crack house. Oh, I didn't yeah, know. I didn't know. I didn't, I didn't, I didn't, USA, the greatest trap house on earth. The biggest, tra- <laughs> the biggest trap house on earth. <laughs> you can get shot at the grocery you store. Oh, you can get shot at the church. But it's always it's a big shit. trap yeah. house. Yeah. 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 That was like, where's my shit? These motherfuckers shooting. Yeah. They got me fucked up. Yeah. Then, then you see how you see how skaters. You see <laughs> how uh, determined he was to put that fist up. Yep. From yep. the picture, basically like I'm gonna get your, I'm gonna get your. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, that motherfucker, <laughs> that motherfucker, like the 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 Game of Thrones. When he went to the cage. Oh, Amon? <laughs> He's like Amon, a temper tantrum bitch. Okay. Excuse my language. Yeah. Be like, you shunning me? Yeah. You shunning me? I'm surprised they ain't slapped the shit out of Secret Service. Yeah. Y'all let that money He would have if, if they didn't let him take that picture. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or get his shoes, he would have. So that would have messed it all up. Trump. I don't know. Trump wanted Whatever party. again, praying for anyone who was there. and Hardest gangster sale. That's a real thing. <laughs> You know, we we got to be better. We got to fucking do be better. Trump being getting shot at. Like, I don't know. Which is worse, a trap house or a crack house? They, they the same. Oh. Well, could we have a marijuana house? Let's <laughs> let's aspire for that one. Where's <laughs> right. That Ooh. seems more chill. <laughs> they had them. They had them all over. They yeah, I know. I need yeah. I need us as a collective <laughs> yeah. uh-huh. to be a marijuana house. <laughs> Something shit. Trump. Uh, yeah. There you go. Um, That's just everyday in the hood shit right there. <laughs> the way he responded. And it's and his cohorts, the people behind him, they like that shit ain't man. <laughs> yeah. Anywho, people, um people presidents get shot out. That's what it's well, that, That's why I tried to tell her earlier. I said the motherfuckers I mean, they're used to gunshots and shit. Yeah, they used to <laughs> like, they, they knew what it was. Remember Dick Cheney? They was duck hunting. And he, and he got shot in the fucking face. He, he shot somebody. No, he, he shot, shot somebody. somebody. Oh, yeah. And that, yeah. Yeah. that person still probably hanging with Dick Cheney. Still <laughs> hanging with him. The <laughs> butt shot. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Damn. And, he, and he came out and apologized to his yeah. ass. Goddamn, Dick. And he was still, <laughs> still pulling me yeah. out of his fucking face. Yeah. I apologized. Yeah. I, I was in his line. I was in the fire. fire yeah. No. Okay. Yeah. So, anyways, um, <clears throat> back to Houston news over here. Um, Hurricane Barrel. Good old Barrel. Um, I would like to let me tell a feel good story that meant a lot to me, really quick, and then I got to talk. We got to talk about Center Point and our uh, 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 politicians here, if we if we can. Um, so during that situation of no power, um, a lot of people are getting it back now. Uh, tequila, you got yours back. Yay. My camera just came on. Yeah. <laughs> Ten that's, minutes ago. That's like, what, yeah. six days? Seven six days, days. Six yeah. days. Yeah. Uh, six. Our gangsta just got hers um, today, too. So six days for her. Like, complete opposites areas. This is what I'm saying. Like, um, during that, I decided to download the neighborhood app or whatever you call that. Um, next door? Next, yeah, next door, which people have told me to do, but I don't like to do it because I had to get froggy a couple times. Man, next yeah. door had, had yeah. the bug. Yeah, bug, yeah, bug, I man. literally, I'm going to delete it. <laughs> I deleted it. I don't yeah, have yeah, it. Yeah, I'm, like, I'm going to delete it. Yeah. I had it on just to, like because I feel like us as civilians... We're tracking I power did, outages better than fucking Starpoint. I, I deleted it because people used to put spiders on that bitch talking about what species of spiders. <laughs> you didn't want to know. Yeah. Yeah. I got arachnophobia. Yeah. I don't see that shit. So I have um, the Ring app. You crack my screen. That shit. Already. That, they don't talk that much on there. You don't have to see what people are saying that much. Well, anyway, someone earlier in the day during one of the power outage days, at least in this area, lost their dog. And, like, five plus hours later, I see a post on the other app that I just downloaded that somebody found a dog that sounded just like the other one. So I messaged that person and said, um, hey, uh, there's someone on the Ring app that says they lost a black pug. Um, And then he said, can you get their info? Because I don't have that app. So then I had to go back and search. 
because obviously everybody's freaking the fuck out about power. Search and find that post and said, hey, there's someone that found a black pug. Uh, he's asking for your info. She immediately texted me her number in the app. I sent it to him he, and said, hope, hope it's the same dog. And it turned out to be the same dog. Congratulations. And they have been looking all day long. So they picked up their dog at like 10 o'clock at night. And I think she posted that at like the day before, maybe. I don't know. That she, and she was crying, but yeah, I was really proud of myself because I was tired as shit. I was going to bed and hot. <laughs> um, so, yay, that's my good deed for the year. Don't ask me for shit else. <laughs> yeah. Good job. I, I love the dogs. I think somebody, same thing happened with a, uh, a Great Dane, a, a Bremo, Bremo, Great Dane. Somebody posted, somebody Great Dane just walking around the neighborhood and then today somebody like, we lost our Great Dane and his name and all that and an hour later. That's awesome. They was back with they, they dog. I love like, it. Yeah. I love it. The next door good for that. Pets. Yeah. 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 I, yeah. And spiders. <laughs> spiders. And spider identification. And, <laughs> and, and I found, I found my, I had to replace my garage door opener last year or something, the, the whole garage thing. And I found the guy on next door that came and did it at a real decent price. Brought the brand new opener and all that shit for him at a real good, real good yeah. price. But you guys fucked it up for him with them spiders. Yeah. So I still get the email. <laughs> so I, I can read the threads through the email. I just yeah. don't have the app. Yeah. Fuck that app. The whole time I was like, I hope I'm not setting these people up for some crazy shit. No. <laughs> what if this guy is Culture lying? He doesn't really have a dog. <laughs> what, if, dog. what if they're both terrible people and they're just a breeder or something? Like, I just, but it sounded wholesome. So, yeah. Me for that. So, one thing I did, and I don't know how it's going to turn out, I don't, I don't ever do this shit. Um, but sitting in the hot house, you know what I'm saying? Thinking what would my ancestors, if what my ancestors would do. <laughs> got this downtime. It's hot. Yeah. YouTube and got bored. <laughs> the phone, the battery on ten percent. Let me do something productive before I lose this battery. I have to go sit in the car and charge it. So, FEMA is offering. Seven hundred dollars, seven hundred fifty dollars assistance on if you lost groceries and shit. Yeah. So yeah. I filled out the application. You did? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are you guys sending it over? Because I, I lost <laughs> yeah, that. I sent it to you. Okay, well, thank you. Know, you. I don't know what the response is gonna be. Yeah, well. They ask like, what's your gross annual income? You know what I'm saying? But it don't matter. I still it lost my groceries. I still lost my fucking groceries. But um, yeah, we're gonna see. Oh, yeah, send that over to me yeah. because I had just grocery shop, yeah. literally, and went yeah. to the farmer's market, which I hadn't been to in months and months and months, and that shit is gone. Yes. <laughs> so. That's what I tell my mom. I say, you know, I don't ever do this shit. I let people do this who really need it, but shit, fuck it. <laughs> I'm going to share this shit. No, I really, yeah. no, I really need it. Yeah, I, I need it. Well, the first year, I don't know. They'll just print it. Don't worry. Yeah. yeah. Well, since you, since, since you said that, since you said that, let's talk. Let's talk about center points, bitch. Let's talk about center points, bitch. Ass real quick. What I want to say is, um, I've lived here over two decades now. I think at this point, um, I know both of you guys pretty much just grew up here, um, aside from you know, um, gangsta. It's usually sometimes in here. Everyone remembers worse storms than that. Everyone has gone through shit. The response of this is absolutely fucking ridiculous. We all knew it was coming. And I am so fucking tired of Center Point. And I'm tired of us being a privatized uh, electric grid company here in Texas in general. Um, 
you know, and I talk to someone and I hate when people like open their mouths and they don't know what the fuck they're talking about, but you know, it's, oh, it was Mayor Turner's fault for, for getting with center point. No, this happened in 1995 and it was the Senate and it is up to the Senate to, um, keep those contracts going. It's not a may mayor thing. Um, and I don't like Turner, so I'm just throwing that out there for people who are like, oh, she's just a fan. Um, part of what the previous, before this happened. I like term. Okay, okay, I don't even, I don't even. Um, part of it, when it wasn't privatized to Companies, CEOs, and people you got to pay. Even though you lie about the potholes. Over. Yeah. He, yeah. They, they all lie about yeah. the potholes. <laughs> Damn. Um, is the money that we were putting into our electricity bills and things that were much cheaper back then. Um, they were obligated to use that money to maintain trees, trim trees, um, fix things that could be a problem because this is storms aren't a new thing i mean they're more frequent and shit now i couldn't tell you why um and center point and enron prior to them we know what happened with enron <laughs> um don't do that they basically just say fuck it and buy ferraris and lamborghinis and sniff it all of our money that we're spending and wait for a storm to hit and then go, uh Oh, and then wait for FEMA to take care of it because why would they spend their money when they know if it's a disaster, it'll be a nationwide issue. Yeah. There will be no surrender. Yeah. yeah. But I thought we were self-sufficient here in Texas. I thought we didn't need anybody. So supreme. Yeah. But, but but yet I'm still looking out the window and seeing above ground power lines. Um, on old rickety poles. On old rickety poles and old That's and old and old trees. That's new one. And old trees and everything else. <coughs> and the answer is, Excuse me. we still got it. But. Yeah, I'm just, I'm fucking annoyed, and I think everyone across any political party, whatever you guys claim you guys are, donkey, the elephant, whatever, I'm not in any of those. I think everybody's fucking pissed. And um, it's time to make uh, heads roll, not literally, like don't start like shooting people in the ear and stuff. But um, we have to keep these people accountable, because a lot of people are struggling, like, you know, I'm complaining because it's hot, but luckily, you know, I still have water. There's people that didn't have water. Um, there's people that don't have gas still now or power still now. Um, that's fucking unacceptable. I don't know how much your electricity bill is, uh, tequila, but ours last month was like $700. We're only two people. Yeah, it don't matter what it is. I had to pay this. Yeah, right. I'm just saying. With no power. Where the seven hundred? Where the seven hundred come yeah. from? A, and where did it go? B. Yeah. That sounds like robbery. We're only two people in here, we, and we work like yeah. like we're not like sitting in here fucking uh, basking in the the lights and. Uh, yeah, it just doesn't make sense, and I hope it doesn't make sense to a lot of people. I feel like it doesn't, because I know people from all political sides that are fucking pissed and tired of this shit. Yeah, it's bullshit. Yeah. And um, shout out to the technicians yeah. out there yes. that drive the, the trucks and out actually doing the work. Yeah. Because a lot of people take the shit out on them. But those yeah. those dudes, they probably don't have power at their fucking house. Yeah. And they out there trying to, number one, they follow the guidance from their bosses. Everybody yeah. working yeah. somebody, so they got to do whatever their bosses tell them to do. Yeah. So, because they, somebody in Fort Bend County, why they pull the gun on the motherfucking yeah. worker? What the fuck? Yeah. What the fuck you pull the gun on? He's struggling with you. He's struggling with you. Stupid <laughs> ass shit. That's yeah. some stupid yeah. ass shit. And yeah, um, thank you for they your shooting service. in the ear. Honestly, <laughs> honestly, thank you. Thank you for your service. Yeah. Um, not even just 
center point people, workers, um, the people workers. that came from yeah. out of state, out yeah. of cities. Yeah. Um, but here's another problem I have with that. Nobody's, I mean, people are mad at the workers because that's, They're uh, not I, that's, that's like a projection yeah. type bullshit. Yeah. Like you can't get to, Yeah. that's why I'm saying I agree with Tequila, focus on who the actual problem is. Yeah. Because I know that a lot of us, I saw it myself, um, I saw it on the apps and things, I saw it uh, on social media and stuff, saw trucks just sitting there. And the reason they were just sitting there is because they're not on center point payroll. So they came to help, which is what is a normal thing. When Florida has disasters, they employ center point will go out there and yeah. they'll pay center point. And I, we're looking worse in Florida here at this point. That's a scary thought. Um, yeah, because Florida got underground. Yeah. Power of the Yeah. 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 Um, we should have like been, yeah exactly um, no I you've been saying that I'm just saying I've been saying that for that we had people years. here prepared to help mm-hmm. and they could not do it because they could not get paid or give permission wow. given permission I know that just the simple seven hundred last month would have fixed at least this neighborhood <laughs> paying them to, to fucking recharge something because there's no trees no trees hit any lines over here i've looked it it it, it just it's ridiculous that we we're gonna have to all unify and fix this here in texas it's the most united i've seen everybody pissed off at the same issue so Mm -hmm. fingers crossed this is our second national not national but state disaster episode because we're in we had to freeze and we well, talk, we, we that was the this. first time that happened. Yeah, yeah, we were talking about the same fucking like thing. Yep. About the grid. Yep. And you know, this was a very humbling experience. Humbling experience for me. He's from Texas. Yeah. Uh, humbling. You know, because my mother Humble. my mother my mother lived with me. And you know, really it's just I I'm a take charge type person. Yeah. Figure shit out. You know what I'm saying? And, and, but it's like out of my control. Nothing I can do. Just we gotta suck it up. But I mean, it's shit that I can do. But shit that I, I just like, man, we gonna give it to Sunday, and then we'll label it as a stream. Because in most cases, like we we've all been through hurricanes before. This is just a category one. Four, five, six, seven days without power. You know, that's standard for a horrible storm. You know what I'm saying? And um, during a horrible storm, I, I, the, the longest I've been without power, maybe one or two days. But I just think about the people that been without power three weeks and, and shit like that. And I just ain't want to get bitten out of shape over five or six days. And it was tough. It was tough. You know what I'm saying? I've really been counting my blessings all week because I'm like, at least I'm in the bed. It's it's people, people that I know personally Mm -hmm. that's like, in this heat, in this weather, in the streets, no, with with no shelter and and shit. So I just counted my blessings, stayed stayed humble, and tried not to get upset. But bullshit is bullshit. You got to call it what it is. I mean, no. Center point, center point, gotta gotta do a better job. Like I had people on the app, um, not from bad areas because I follow kind of this whole area, um, that were begging people with a generator to refrigerate their insulin. Yeah. Or could they yeah. charge their oxygen? Yeah. And shit like that's scary. Yeah. The great, the great, we're the fourth largest city, third or fourth largest. Uh, city. Yeah. That's insane. Because people are like, Dance, I can't believe. Oh, shit, I said my last name. <laughs> you, know, you can't believe you don't have a generator. Well, I'm like, I know, but I never <laughs> never need one. Yeah, because you, know you can suck it up. You <laughs> suck it up for yeah. like a couple days. Yeah, I'm not like, okay, before, but you never, but never like this. You yeah, know what I mean? But yeah, I and know. shout out to you. Yeah. you, you know, you, like you said, you have your mom there. Shout out to her too. 
Well, that's why I said that, that's when I told my coworker, man, we from Roshan, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We come up with no AC. I said I didn't get introduced there. Air conditioning because I was probably about 16 or 17. So yeah. all we had was one of them square ass fans. You put that shit in the window and uh, yeah, take, she take, couldn't the even shirt, do that. take the shirt off. Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> and then walk around and hear the dun dun dun. Yeah, but she, <laughs> you and your mama can't walk around and hear the dun dun Yeah, so you, you, stay on that side. So you stay on that side of the house and I'm going to stay on this side of the house. And then my son always going to stay where he's and on this side. He's just house. always going to be this. Yeah, and he always has no shirt on that. With, like, with the AC this is my normal outfit <laughs> yeah. in the house. <laughs> well, I'm glad you guys have gotten on. I'm excited for you to get back and get some normalcy, hopefully, until the next person sees it's too hard. But that's, what, that's how I feel about our grid at this point. If, if too many people yeah, see it's too hard at the it. same time, yeah. we're all going to be out of power again. Yeah. And I think we're all looking at you know, because again, this is summer. This isn't even hurricane season, y'all. <laughs> like, this is, is, and this is the dead of summer. And every time it rains, most people we'd be like, "Yay, we got rain!" Because it's fucking 101 degrees outside. Now you're just looking at it like, "Well, fuck! Please don't, <laughs> please, please, please don't knock the power out again." And but and where I, what what pissed me off really? Because where I live, they do those rolling blackouts. They plan oh, blackouts. Yeah. Mm, yeah. You know, at least it's once. It's like they open the flood thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. At least once a week, mm-hmm. they, they shut our power off for about two, three minutes. And and if you do the math, if they save a lot of fucking money. You know what I'm saying? They shut my power off for two, three minutes. Your power, they saving a lot. They, they saving a the grid. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And they saving a lot of money because we paying for that time that the power off. You know what I'm saying? And they do that shit all the time. Even when we lost power, as soon as Burl, good old Burl, hit hit Matagorda County, as soon as it hit land, my power went off. Yeah. I'm, I'm up at three watching the news, and as soon as it, it made landfall, yeah. <laughs> two hours yeah, later, I watched the it came and back on. was like, I don't understand how it is turned, how hard it is to turn the power back on, because we had power, and y'all just turned it, it off turned voluntarily. Off. Yeah, yeah. And turned it back on two hours later. And then that shit went off again and never came back on. Yeah. When the transformers. I think we're t- I think I think shit. us as a collective are about to say, Center Point, you didn't fuck around, you're about to find out. <laughs> so what do y'all think about this? What? We're talking about generators. I've been researching. Okay. They had these batteries. I thought we were storming the storming the center point capital. <laughs> uh, they, 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 they have they, they have a battery option. Where you can uh, keep your house lit off these batteries. I think Tesla got one, but this other company, they don't have them in Texas yet, but they come to Texas. And the battery only costs three grand. So if you get the the, the, the right generator hooked up to your house, running off your gas, you're talking about ten, fifteen thousand dollars. But this battery, it's about three grand. So three just grand. turn your electricity off. No, just the the, the battery gonna keep you keep you warm. When you lose power. Oh, when you lose. Yeah. Instead of the generator, you have a battery pack. But how long do you have to charge that battery? It stays charging. I mean, I, I have, it's, it's, it stays charging the whole while you got power and shit. So when oh, you it's lose constantly power, charging. Yeah, so when oh. you lose power, it, it kicks on. It's probably. I don't know how long it's gonna last. Maybe better for the environment. It's better for the environment. But maybe it's not loud. Not making noise. I don't know, man. Because, it, but it'll do the whole house. Yeah. I feel like if you got it, I would get one of each. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a twenty thousand dollar drum. <laughs> but try to try them both. Fuck it. <laughs> I don't know. I really don't even know that much about generators, to be quite honest. I just know you need one to keep your power on. So <laughs> I know because I can't. Tr- I can't trust the shout utility out, company. Shout out to um, my neighbor that lived behind me. You know because when I sleep, I need background noise. So I, I have a television on, but his generator been my background noise. That one was just a wah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't even. As soon as he run out of gas, I wake up. Like if my teeth. Oh, yes. <laughs> he gonna put gas and then oh, start back, start back up. You should. I'm you know crashing. what? 
You know what? Next time that happens, just get Rob there. He'll talk to you the whole time. He's so damn poor because it's quiet. I've been talking for 20 minutes. No, I'm talking about when the power oh. was on. And I was like, yo, I, I just need a minute. I just, I'm trying. I don't sweat. It takes a lot for me to sweat. And I was like, dri- I took a cold shower. I fucking hate, loathe cold showers. Took one, got out, and still sweat. And you know, that's another blessing. Oh, I, water. I had water, I had gas, you mm-hmm. know, we cooking and shit. You mm-hmm. know what I'm saying? In the end of the day, you got the, the sunlight, so you're not really, other than the heat. Yeah, that made it and, and not no, dark. No entertainment. It was still hot. <laughs> yeah, but I was sitting in front of the window. It, you know, it just, it was real humbling. I, you I, 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 kind of I, I think. I no, think, you, you I sound so much better shit. than me. Yeah. He, had yeah. A, he had a. I needed that. Yeah. I needed, you know what I needed? I needed the Monday off that I was supposed to have. <laughs> As a replacement for my July 4th not being off and working the office July 5th by myself. So I, I'm going to need a redo of that. That's what I mean. I know. Uh, you'll be on vacation next week. That's not a vacation. <laughs> hosting family is not a vacation. I don't know what happened Wednesday, though. Oh, Wednesday. Wednesday, I think Lucifer was like, oh, yeah. walking that, around. That was the worst. Shit. That was, was the worst. <laughs> it's, Man, it was so funny. I've never been that hot before in my life. Yep. Wednesday. I don't know what. Yep. It was like, fuck the dunthin' in this. Yeah. Because you know why? Did you <laughs> have your windows open at Yeah. All? Okay, there was, was no breeze. Yeah, That's why. Was hot as when it. there was, like, yeah. breeze coming through, it yeah. made it better. Yeah. That Wednesday, there was no fucking breeze. Because we had the windows open, too, and it didn't matter what room. Like, I, we were in Harper's room. Because they have those blackout curtains, yeah. and it was cooler than it wasn't, and it was just dripping. It was Wednesday was crazy. Yeah, I was sleeping on tiles and shit just because I was. That's how soaked yeah. and sweat, man. That shit was crazy. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know what happened on Wednesday, but yeah, shit. Yeah. That was sorry. That was um. I fell for my cousin. He was in Death of Storm. He used to talk about how hot it was. My dad was in the store. He used to talk about how hot it got out. Like, shit. I don't know how you had that fucking uniform on and shit. Yeah. That's crazy. And then my car wouldn't start for a little while there. So that was interesting. I thought you just had your car service. I did. Two weeks ago. Mercedes is about to have a whole bad attitude for me. I haven't been able to drive it like far, especially because I'm scared to drive it like by myself. Um, but they came and jumped it. They were going to tow it to Mercedes and they jumped it, but it still sounds like it's struggling sometimes. I don't like that shit. Did they tighten up the cables or anything? No, he just he came to take it and he goes, can I just try to jump it? Because... Well, no, you said you said it was not the battery. But it, was okay, in my okay. Bed. Okay. Well, anywho, but we you know somebody would jump our cables. Um, there's probably one right here, mm-hmm. over here, that we could have tried it if you couldn't figure out where they were. Anywho, he well, jumped it. Car one on one is always jump started. That's one on one. Just try to I jump should. that one. Well, I don't know shit about cars. Yeah. I just listen. And uh, anyways, he jump started it and it works. Um, and then that night we were able to actually sleep in it. But then I was trying to drive it around, and it just it it gave up. But it started, so I I, I may need a new battery, but it still makes no sense because they test the battery, and I was in green. Like I don't know yeah. how other dealerships works, but when you take it in for service, they tell you, hey. But something yeah. might be draining it, like roast it, and alternator can drain it a bad alternator. Right, but they yeah. sent me greens on all of those things <laughs> because I was prepared to. Well, it just could fix be a, it, fix they it. could just be a fluke. They have flukes. 
then they may be just tightening well, your tail. I'm about to fluke my ass yeah. to a Tesla is what's going to happen. <laughs> maybe, maybe you need to go to Germany. German? I am sure. According no, no. to your dad, he's living in Germany. He was born there. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's German. He should have looked at the farm and be like, "Oh, H I I have a lot of um, knowledge about a lot of things. Cars is not it. I am literally like, "Oh, that's sexy. Can I afford it?" That's literally how I operate with cars. And when I say afford, it means the insurance, the payment, and upkeep, and that type of thing, and that's how I operate. So I, I don't know how to fix it. That's why I need to be able to maintain the upkeep. <laughs> and then if you get these foreigns, your warranty makes you go to the dealership. <laughs> so that's another thing. The warranty, and they have all these motherfucking codes. Yeah. That mechanics can't afford to get the codes. Yeah, to repair them. To repair them, so they, yeah. you force they forced to go to the gym. Shout out to um, Drake at uh, Green Wave, though, because I texted him um, and was like, yo, XYZ, and he wasn't even working, and he did get back to me. He's a service provider there. Um, super nice guy, except he keeps calling me ma'am, and I'm not that old. But he was like, just ca- call them to the, the you know, to tow it. And I was like, well, do I need to make an appointment with you? Or are they going to know? And he goes, no, no, just go ahead. They'll do it. And, and then he checked up. And was like, were they able to tow it? Or, you know, so shout out to him. That was very nice. Because he wasn't even working. I was like, my bad. <laughs> no worries, ma'am. <laughs> but I didn't check him on the ma'am this time. Because I was just like, what's wrong with my car? But if the shit's not working by this weekend, I will be. Y'all need to do what it do before I call Elon. Just saying. So, anyways, <clears throat> so my hurricane experience um, was drippy. <laughs> it's very drippy and windy. Drippy. <laughs> Trees falling. Yeah. Everything. So, oh. Uh, no, my hurricane experience was uh, people asking me a lot of questions that made no sense. Like, so, oh, was what? good? Oh, how are you doing? Nope. And, uh, you know, I'm trying to say bad way on my phone. I'm also trying to hopefully that you say this correctly. <laughs> good. <laughs> Yeah, good. How are you doing? <laughs> I asked you first how you're doing. So I started that conversation. Um, yeah, we have power, no. We have power, yes. We have power, no. We have power, yes. But why the fuck are you going to continue to ask me? If I have power, I'm gonna let you know. Yeah. If we have power, I'm gonna let you know. So a side note is is our business did not have power this whole entire week. Hopefully it does now. Um, but you know, we have we employ this people all over the state of Texas and you know I'm gonna let you know. They're um concerned about their orders going out and things and well, you et cetera. Have. No, I'm just, I'm, I'm just saying, you know, they're concerned because if you're not here right now, people aren't understanding in an outskirt area. Um, well, they made sure but they need, understand yes, yes, the outskirts are Right, but, you know, when, when other areas, yes, and raining, or and when, they can't drive storms, nowhere, and they got an accident, right, and yeah. they did this. It's just a lot. They, uh, it's honestly like, just pick up the phone and look at the news or watch the news. We're dealing with a lot here in uh, Houston and the surrounding areas. So, um, doing the best we can. Yeah, we just got power back. Girl, Ford with us. 
Right. Yeah. <laughs> this job. Like, this job. <laughs> this job. <laughs> but the other job. Yeah. The other job. I'm like, we don't even know yet. Yo, I'll tell you. I will <clears throat> brief you on the circumstances on when things are going to happen for you. Oh, my bad. My bad. My bad. Yeah. But I will it's be a the really shitty time frame too. first one to call you. I'll be I'm the about first to be one on to call you. On my vacation. Right? <laughs> I'll be the first one to let you know. Okay. How many times are you going to say that? Hmm? You have to tell us the same amount of times you text them that on the air, yes. too? Yes. <laughs> Pretty much. Good Lord. Anywho, um, yeah, the other, the only thing that's in my brain to chit chat about is House of Dragons, but that's coming in about two more episodes. Don't we have to watch that? Yes, yes, that's what I said. I said it'd take about two more episodes because I got some shit to say. Lord. What about the FCs? The who? FCs. FCs. Yeah, sports stuff. Uh, I didn't they, watch they it. They said it was, I didn't either, but they said it was a... I couldn't. <laughs> yeah. What? You couldn't. Because they, they said it was a declaration uh, for for women this year. I mean, I yeah. saw some bad bitches yeah. for All, pictures. A lot of awards and shit went to most of the female, which is awesome in my opinion. Finally. Yeah, but, uh, Finally. They need to pay them. You know, that don't give them all those accolades and shit and still pay them like they in college. You know what I'm saying? I found a couple of wifeies. Yo, so why you, what, 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 you bought a ticket for a WNBA game? We don't have a team. We don't have a team. Huh? We, have a team. we got to fly. We have. Uh, we don't have it. But. Did you go to the Commons game? I, was, I didn't go to the Commons game. Did you? No. Yeah, I would have, but I was dealing with other shit back then. Uh-oh. And, 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 <laughs> and, and, and that's and, and that, and, and that's yeah, called mind your fucking business. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. Um, I'll yeah. go. Y'all would have made Cynthia Cooper. Man, yeah. come on. The, that, that's, that's what the WNBA this, was. This is him and he recognized, he recognized yeah. fucking WNBA players before I did. So it's not back when, I mean, when we went what? to Grand Lux, you didn't go, hey, look, that's a, that's, it's yeah. Rich Miller's sister. Yeah. 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 And? Okay, well, it's good. It's, their, it's Lisa, their time. Lisa I'm in the basketball. Lisa so, Leslie. Or I told you. Cynthia Cooper. What the other rock the comic zero name? We had Cynthia so Cooper, Cooper and um, um, that's very me either. Um, nah, them girls are balling, man. But uh, no, I I already told you that I played against yeah. one girl um in high school, and I said she crossed my ass up. I was like, oh. Yeah, and you played right. one outside yeah. of high school that crossed your ass. I, I came up, I came up with like that. That was me. Were you playing on a blacktop, girl? It was cold. Yeah, so sorry. Yeah, we, yeah, we playing on a black blacktop. It was cold. Girl, girl, so girl, girl let your ass up. Hell yeah. <laughs> yeah, my no, cousin. she was thick. My cousin. But they won the championship. My cousin Vicky and my cousin Janice. So you can. Your you own cousin. Yeah. 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 Be your own. Be your own. Be your own. If the time was right, they'd be WNBA. Huh. If the. Lady, you ain't got no laws. Yeah. You are that's it for this week's episode of Cognac, Tequila, and the Girl. Be sure to like, follow, and subscribe on your favorite podcast app. As always, we'd love to hear your feedback. Follow us on all the social medias. Leave your comments and reviews. Until next week, keep safe and keep your squad close. Thanks for hanging out.